Hello everyone. Usually I talk about non-conspiracy, non-emotion stirring subjects. Today an article was brought to my attention and this article said and stated that Americans have basically lost faith in everything. Everything from religion to government to the banking system to the way of, of, of everyday life there is no faith, there is no trust, there's no belief. How can there be any faith, any trust, any belief when you have all this misinformation, all this lies, all this misdirections when you're doing a search for something, when you have paid government trolls that are actually there to not only discredit your work, but to also break it down and get you upset to the point that you don't want to do this anymore. I'm talking about the social media sites. All social media sites are not only monitored, but at the same time, there is bills right now that are stating that the media sites be used to not only collect information, but to be used against any individual that is talking their mind, that is talking their free thought. In my opinion, this is all meant to be. Because if we're all going to spend our time not truly breaking free of the system, and what do I mean by breaking free of the system? Today is 93 degrees. It's 72% dew point. So I am naked. I am sitting on my backyard sweating and uh, making this video. Breaking free of the system means not using your air conditioner if you don't have enough solar panels in your roof to provide you the electricity that is necessary to run that air conditioner. Going against the system means not shopping at the major supermarket where everything is corporate shop your local grocer shop your local convenience store something that is a local business where do you eat do you eat at a major fast food restaurant or do you eat at your local food joint a hole in the wall that's dirty and grimy but the food is so good where do you go where do you go shopping do you shop at Macy's, Walmart, Kmart, Target? No. Shop your local thrift shop, your local Goodwill shop. You can find designer clothes over there that are worth a hundred, two hundred, three hundred dollars at those major, major corporation shops for twenty bucks, five bucks, two bucks. And you know what? It looks just as good on you as it would look on the person that spent $200 for. No reason, no reason to spend that amount of ridiculous money for that sort of thing. Okay, you have a specialty need. You need jogging sneakers that cost you X amount of dollars and they go for X amount of miles. Okay, spend that money. Support that business. Fine not a problem there because it is a specialty and you need to get it that gives you the performance you need to do what you have to do. Where do you do your banking? Do you do your bank at a Bank of America's? Or do you do your banking at TD Bank North? Whatever it is. Support your local bank. Support your local credit union. Credit unions are usually supported within that state itself Therefore, it's not a corporate entity. Well, it is a corporate entity, but it's not going towards a corporate bullshit fund. Forgive my language. I'm just a little frustrated and being naked, um, the wind feels good. Now, if we all fail, if we all fail, it's over. Not over just for humanity but our everyday way of life. And for you people out there that says, no, it doesn't affect me, it can't happen to me, 
or I have this ready to go, or I have this ready to go, I'm all prepared and ready to go. Question to you is how are you helping? How are you making a difference in other people's lives to make them aware that the system we're under just does not work? Religion, politics are the same thing. Science, politics is the same thing. Anywhere you go, everything is structured in such a way for failure. One thing that can let us expand our mind and grow as who we are is to step out of the system. Step out of the system in a way that you can provide yourself freedom and not depend on anything or anyone for your livelihood. I don't shop at the Goodwill shop or my local grocer. Don't even turn my air conditioner on when it's this hot because my energy I supply for myself. And being energy being, I am free to do as I please. I'm sorry, let me say one thing correctly. I do need internet. I have yet not found a provider that is not a corporate provider. But once I do, I guarantee you I will be escaping that as well. So the internet I am guilty of and I apologize for that. But we all have to look for ways to evade the system. Not in a malicious way, not in a, in a way that causes harm to other people. But just do not support any corporate entity that is your owner. Because TV programs your mind to consume. Music programs your mind to feel emotions that are not yours. And it all leads up to a tragic end of humanity. But what do I know? Thank you for watching. I had to get that off my chest. Choose. Choose wisely. Peace.